Hey guys, what is up? It is your friend Nobody was here. Back again with another Isaac Breaking Man. This time we're gonna start with the Halo. And I just want to have this as a, a preface to this run. Um, I, uh, I'm a bit on the tired side. So I imagine I will make quite a few mistakes and get hit by quite a few enemies that I should never get hit by. Um, I did stream some Magic the Gathering tonight. Uh, did a Swiss draft of Dragons of Tarkir, as well as played some games of Standard with that sweet Jeskai deck that I uh, showed off on the channel a little bit ago, a couple weeks or something. But, um, yeah, and I the thing is, in the, the Standard matches, I did one more match to like close it out, right? Because I'm like, I'm not gonna, you know, just end on doing awful in the draft or whatever. So I decided to end on another match of Standard, which I won! Uh, but I won with four minutes left on the clock and also punted it real hard many times in a row. Please, dude. This is why I don't like this room. Alright, we're good. So, uh, yeah, basically I'm trying to tell you that I'm gonna get hit a lot. Uh, so don't expect this to be good in terms of skill, although it could still be entertaining in terms of content. So you know, don't be don't be too discouraged by this long drawn out uh, warning. <laughs> Alright, you're you're acting like a piece of shit, dumbass fucking spider piece of motherfucker. Stupid motherfucking motherfucker. Nub spider nubs fucking little thing that of course because I don't have enough rooms to re-roll. Alright, let's get into it. Oh, I can see again. Curse of Darkness is kinda weird because it's like 50% of the time it doesn't affect me at all. And then the other 50% of the time it's actually like super dark. Also, every single one of these except for one <laughs> turned into a body. Alright. It's a little weird. Seems a little unlikely. But I guess I should say why I took the Halo. Uh, because I haven't done uh, an all stats up starting item in a while. That's about it. And also I was already resetting for like five minutes and was like, alright, there's nothing good. Let's just go with the first thing that I think is a good item. Regardless of how interesting it is. And the uh, Halo was that. So, ugh. I was thinking, what could punish me for putting the bomb down early? Turns out, exactly the thing that happened. Ah! Damn it! Oh god, now I'm in a dangerous... This is a dangerous game. It's really... Alright, okay. This is actually awful. Told ya! It wouldn't be pretty. Ah. So what we're gonna do, is we're gonna roll with this, right? And then we're gonna bleh! And then it's gonna blow it up! Yeah! It did! We got a bomb back. That's pretty good. I'm not going to reroll this because I do want to see the whole floor first. See all the pedestals available first. Because I uh, there's not enough rooms to get an extra reroll, especially at this point. But kind of in general as well. Um, so I do want to see all the pedestals. Deck of cards. Suicide King. Well, could go out in style, I guess. Um, either of those is from the item room, so I'm gonna just keep going and see if we can find, hopefully find another Tinted Rock. If not, then hopefully just don't ever get hit, which is looking difficult right about now. This is not what I would call an ideal room to not get hit in. Maybe through. Okay, golden chest. Spirit Heart one time. Damn it. All right. Just don't get hit. Oh, it's Monstro. If we get hit now, it's all over. This is, this is where it all ends. This is where my Isaac career comes to a screeching halt. That's ah, that's one of my favorite ways to just like, you know, my one of my favorite, uh, I guess, adjectives, kind of a phrase. It's like, it's uh, the adjective is screeching. Halt is a noun, but together it creates a thing that has a term, but I'm just lost. It's fine, whatever. It's one of my favorite ones. Okay. <laughs> so this floor's not great. Yeah, 
This floor is not good. I'm going to take Placenta, and then I'm going to backtrack. And I'm going to reroll uh, one of these two items. It's kind of irrelevant, so... Sure, Spider Bite. Does help us. <laughs> it, is, it is useful. Alright, so this should be our secret room. If it's not, I'll be really upset. And of course, it is. And up to 20 cents. Do not have a key, unfortunately, and the key in the room to the north of us uh, is blocked off by a pit without rocks, so we can't access that key. So we're actually just rolling keyless right now, which is fine. I don't like it, but I, I don't like the no keys from that either. It's okay then. We can, we can live with this. We can roll with that. I just want to get them all down to the ooze at least once um, because then they have the reduced health to get into it. Okay. Also, they seem to be new objects every time they go to ooze or vice versa because they're getting slowed on the first hit of spider bite every time. So, And that kind of adds up because they can drop a shitload of, spirit, or a, a shitload of red hearts if you have Gimpy. So they are treated as new objects for Gimpy, which is cool. So I guess it makes sense that they're treated as new objects for everything else. Okay, we have a shitload of money, but nothing to do with it, because we don't have keys. Getting taunted. Alright, sun card, get me out of here. That's the room of death. At the very least, it's the room of take a shitload of damage. I'm gonna bomb here. It's not a black heart. It's a card. Stars. Brings us to our item room. I like that, actually. I'm a glutton for punishment. I'm sorry. I cannot. We have Spider Bite. It's actually pretty good. Oh, no. <laughs> this, this is not a room I wish to deal with. <laughs> well, it's not that bad, apparently. I guess the spider bite's pretty good. All right, I can I can dig it. I can dig it. I can't dig this. This is a thing I cannot dig. This is where do I put the shovel in this? I cannot dig it. What the fuck? Am I just a god right now? Is that what's happening? Am I actually just a god? I should have been hit twice in that room. Oh, this this is the room where we get hit. This is for sure. Bats with soy milk is not a not a fun combination. How do we cross over? How do we cross over? How do we cross over? Cross over! Okay, 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 die, yes. And no! Good. Good. Alright, and we got a key, okay! It's not going that bad, actually. I imagine this would be <laughs> much worse. I imagine this would be a train wreck. Although, in fairness, we've only done, what, three rooms? <laughs> so, maybe it will be a train wreck. So, eh, we'll give it time. Don't want to rule out the train wreck yet. Blip. Blip. Okay. Alright, this is, this is the room. Bonies. Bonies. Every room is going to be the room, by the way. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. I still need to see that movie. I reference it a lot. And I haven't seen it. Have I said that I've seen it in the past? I probably have. But I haven't. Knowing me, that sounds like a thing I would lie about. Why I don't know. All right, <laughs> still no spirit hearts. It's not great. Because I just wanted to fit in, guys. The boys at school wouldn't let me fit in if I didn't say that I've seen the room. Mega fatty. Ooh. All right, we'll be here a bit. Crack open a nice big old book that you want to read, and uh, sit down, and relax. This will be a while. Ah, don't do that. 
trap me. Yeah. Ah. Woo. That bullet was coming right at me. I'm glad I actually went for evasive maneuvers. Jeez. Some of these bullets are actually so close to hitting me. Can you stop jumping now? I really don't like it when you jump. Ah! Because the fast jump just gets me every time. Apparently not every time. But it gets me enough that it's terrifying to me. Christ. All you gotta do is hold out, man. That's all you gotta do. Oh. Oh, God. Jesus, God. Oh, God. That's incredible. I, I don't even have words that I can use to describe my happiness. Oh! Uh, it's just, it's all, I'm flipping a coin right now. I'm flipping it. I'm calling heads, and it's just heads, 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 and heads. It's just every time, it's just heads. Now, what I'm interested about is where did my extra charge go? I have a battery. I rerolled once. I had two additional charges, I believe. And I'm down to zero. Where did it go? I do not know. Oh, uh, Guppy's Paw. That's right. Okay. Sure. Guppy's paw does buggy shit with battery and stuff like that. Maybe it's not buggy, maybe it's intended. It, it feels gross that it happens because it's an item that doesn't have charges, but it uses up your excess charge from the battery anyway. Eh, that's fine. I'm not too upset. How did I not get hit there? I gotta, I gotta kill these guys pretty bad. These guys are getting a little, getting a little spooky now. Range down is not what I want to see. Okay. I'm liking the key drops. I'm liking that. Okay. This is an awkward room with our current setup. It's not necessarily like difficult, it's just awkward as fuck. Nice. I'm not gonna go there yet, because I have a battery and I wanna, you know, get my charge ready and shit. Because I would like to reroll twice if it's not looking up to snuff. Yeah, I'm gonna take Gemini. I'm not gonna not take Gemini when I have soy milk. I'm, I'm already predicting it now, by the way. There's gonna be a, at least one comment that's gonna be like, Scumbag Uber Goose saying uh, I'm gonna be bad because I'm tired, then gets most incredible run he's ever imagined. Damn. Yeah, I mean, listen, it happens to the best of us, and it happens to the worst of us. I just happen to be the latter of those, so it might make people upset. That's okay, though. Dodge. Why do I dodge? Why do we dodge? Let's pick ourselves back up. It's a solid Dark Knight Rises reference. Get it? Dark Knight Rises. We pick ourselves back up. Yeah, I'm sure that I'm sure that fucking Christopher Nolan was having himself a giggle. I saw what you did the second you did it, little Chris. I believe my DPS has gone a little bit higher since we last met Mega Fatty. I could be wrong about that, but I believe you're dying a tad bit faster, and you have extra health compared to last time, so 
Ah, god damn it, Mega Fatty. Asshole. So when it comes to the, the Dark Knight trilogy, I'm pretty sure everybody's uh, got the got at least a similar opinion, maybe not the same opinion, but a similar opinion in that it it goes uh, you know best to worst is uh, Dark Knight, Batman Begins, Dark Knight Rises, right? That's pretty. I, I, yeah, I mean that like that's my list. I don't know about you guys, but that's my list for sure. I don't think anybody's gonna disagree that Dark Knight's the best. But I don't think a lot of people even saw Batman Begins, let alone enjoyed it. <laughs> Which is upsetting to me, because I think Batman Begins is incredible. It's an extra spirit heart. That seems pretty good. I'll take that. Uh, yeah, I don't care about anything else. Super Secret Room has been found. Red hearts. Okay, so now we have a full two rerolls for our boss or deal with the devil. Yeah, Batman Begins, I think most people don't remember how good it is because it gets overshadowed by the Dark Knight. And I'll admit, I'm, I'm taking this, this is fine. I'll admit, Dark Knight is like an actual masterpiece compared to the other Dark Knight trilogy movies. You know, Dark Knight Rises and Batman Begins. It's, it's a masterpiece. Absolutely. So, you know what? I'll, I'll concede that, but at the same time, I do think Batman Begins was good as fuck. And if you don't remember what Batman Begins covered, which uh, most people don't remember, it was basically the introduction of Ra's al Ghul and, uh, and uh, basically, like, you know, why he wears the mask or whatever. And, um... Fucking... Uh, as well as the, uh, the, the Scarecrow, who is a, a lawyer by day, and created a, some horrific drug... Fear gas? Is that what it's called? I don't remember. I haven't seen it in a bit. In a hot minute. Um, this is Death's one. Yeah. Um, but he invents that, and then he uses it to wreak havoc on people, and it basically makes you, you know, see your worst nightmare. Why did I run into that? Like, Jesus. No! Well, what are you doing down there, War? Get out of the corner, you butthole. Filthy nerd. You're not a deal with the devil. I will take you. Yeah! Oh god, alright. It's like that's that's the kind of screech I would make while playing tennis or something. I saw the spike. I knew the spike was there. And I just, I just, I narrowly avoided it. By the way, <laughs> there's the, the compilations, right, of like uh, women tennis players doing their fucking screeches during matches. They're so fucking funny. Alright, that didn't even brush me. Get out of here. Uh, they're so fucking funny, though. Because it sounds like they're dying half the time. Not that them dying would be funny, it's just that it's it's comical. It's the thing. Yeah, it's it's super funny to me. I love it. Just hearing them go just, Obviously a bit more feminine, but Actually, that's not at entirely true. A lot of the time, it is pretty. It's pretty manly. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty. It's pretty disgusting. <laughs> Just hearing like a. Ugh! Am I watching again? Also, I'm. I just. I don't want to talk about the fact that my bullets shoved him like a pixel higher than he was actually shooting. 
which ended up hitting me. I, I don't want to talk about it. I'm not a fan of talking about it. Two spades, two hearts. Pop two spades now. Get a shitload of keys. Uh, this is tidy, so this should be a, a trap. Yeah, that's the that's what I was gonna say. This is at the very least a pedestal. So let's pop this. See if we get a battery. Did not. That's okay. Ah, I'm retarded. Actually, I'm retarded. Let's pop it again then. So we've already wasted our bonus charge because I'm an idiot. See, I told you I was tired. <laughs> Monster manual. Let's pop it. See what we get. We got a big fan for the room. See you later, big fan. Spumoni. That's still one of the weirdest things about the battery, is that if you use an item that's not the one you built the charge on, the extra charge is transferred to the new one and gets actually used up on the new one. And I, It's such a feel-bad sort of thing, and it doesn't really make sense, but... There's a key. That's not really what I wanted! I'm not the most upset about it, because having 19 bombs is awesome. Wait, why did I use that? I saw what it was. Alright, I'm just... Listen, I prefaced this run <laughs> with a certain something. You remember that certain something? Just to stop worrying about what's going on right now, okay? Worrying about it is not what you should be doing. What you should be doing is not not watching my videos. Space heater fans are the greatest invention that's ever existed. Okay, blow up the rocks. At least create a path if you're not going to give me something that I want. It's fine. The range down, the second one that I took, was uh, it was just to, you know, give myself a false sense of security. Make it harder for me. You know, keep me on my toes more. So that's like the best thing that could have happened there. One of the best rooms I could have found. Krampus. I don't have a reroll for you. But if you do... If you do drop Lumpicol, I'll be very happy. If you do not, then I'll just hope to actually get... Yeah, okay. Just hope to actually get there. And actually get a deal with the devil. You have died, sir. Yeah, my damage is a little bit high. 2020 is a pretty good synergy item with soy milk. As are, you know, countless damage ups. Right, they're not countless, I can count them. That's awesome. <laughs> Hilarious, what's so fucking funny, Ma? Oh, there's a port. Get out of there. Alright. And that should be. Coinage. What do we got? BFF sounds awesome. Nine volt sounds reasonable. Don't know which one's better. Um, so nine volt gives me immediate value. You know what? Fuck it. Let's take them both. All right. It doesn't give me immediate value. It normally charges you to full, um, which I assume it would have done had I not had full regular charge. I have no overcharge, so I was hoping it would battery me up, but it did not. That's okay. I'm not upset about it. I'm just disappointed. Okay, so now my friends rule, which is, of course, quite good when a good chunk of our DPS, not too much of our DPS, but a good chunk of our DPS is, in fact, um, our, our familiars. I mean, I deal a lot of damage without them, but with them I deal even more, of course. And now that I have BFF, it's even better. You suck. Ah, god damn it. I got caught on a fucking stupid, dumb, idiot, stupid thing. Well, backtracking. I'm, I'm missing a good chunk of health from where I started on this floor, so I really could use some more blue fires, except that payout instead of not. 
blown up four fires that can give me spirit hearts, and not a single spirit heart has dropped. It's not great. Here's a room where we can utilize some good shit. What? Huh? Alright, there was no bullet. That's horseshit. As usual, enemies in Isaac are horseshit. It's two, three hosts with one para card. Temperance. Hosts. Joker. Okay, we'll keep that in mind. Especially when we design this rhyme. Etc. Alright. Emperor. Temperance. The moon. Stop the moon. See where, we're, see where he puts us. That's kind of what I expected. You are not spirit hearts. Okay. Um, drop the temperance. And play it. Play it. Play it. Play it. Blow it up. Take the yoker. What? Please, just one time give me less than three. Please. Lard. Yeah, that's fine. I really... I'm not a huge fan of lard because the speed down generally outweighs the HP up in my mind. But, you know what? I'll roll with it. I did ask for HP up. He obliged. I feel rude not to accept, you know. That's not good. That's not good. That's fine. Well, now I can't reroll our Krampus, which is a little frustrating. Although I could buy the battery. And now I have tons of money. Uh, so I can at least play this two, uh, three times, I think? Three times. Oh, nice. We can play it a bunch now. I could have played one more. It's fine. So I can buy the battery, and that will put us in a pretty good spot. We'll be able to reroll our Krampus item one time. I'll also buy this Spirit Heart, because I can. And I guess I'll buy this. Bad trip. Alright. <laughs> good. Nice. Awesome. Sweet. Oh, okay. I pushed that one, so we're full. On red hearts, at least. Yeah, you seem like the thing I wish to do things with. Dirty, dirty things. Not gonna last. Okay, I was gonna be pretty upset if this was Jerun because I don't, I don't want to have to pick. Okay, so what we can do is grab this and bloop, bloop, bloop. Well, Hagalaz, where can we use you to good effect? I believe this big room is pretty good. There are some skulls. Uh, there seem to be at least seems to be at least one tarot card. So I will check that out. I guess I should have done that first if I was being optimal, but it's not like I'm in a rush. Hangman, you do nothing. We. All right, that's fine. Hopefully our Krampus item immediately rerolls into something worthwhile. Right, we don't fly anymore. <laughs> That's what the hangman does. It makes you think that you actually have flight. Blue Mom. So Blue Mom sucks, except for the fact that you get a Spirit Heart at the end. That, that part kind of rules. At least one Spirit Heart. Sometimes more. Sometimes you actually... I don't think I've ever not gotten any, but I've definitely had like one Spirit Heart and like eight Red Hearts. Back when it was buggy and they dropped a trillion. Oh god damn it. Trillions of hearts for beating mom. Those were the days. Stop it! You're stepping like your red mom. Get out of here. Alright. Poor Babylon. We have a few too many red hearts for this to be really good, but on this floor we can Joker card in case we don't get a deal with the devil and use that to get our whore Babylon state. I have way more health than I anticipated. Come on. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, darkness. Well, 
One of my friends retweeted that on on the Twitters. There's a, a vine, or I guess I guess they didn't retweet. They just linked to the vine. But there was a vine where it was um whatever his, the character's name is. I don't know his name, but the, the frog, the dancing and singing frog. Uh, you know he he's our ally. Like, Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. Or at least, I, I think it was just hello my, hello, my baby, hello, my honey, or whatever. And then he goes into the sound of silence. It's pretty good. It's good stuff. It's really good to tell jokes that are even better when not told and instead experienced, and then saying that they're funny. I think that's the, that's the true secret to comedy. Is just calmly state the joke. I think I've, I've truly cracked the code today. Not good dodging. Not good. It's okay though. You don't have to deal with those stupid leeches anymore. Okay. So I would like to s hopefully get a deal with the devil on the natural. But I know that's not the most likely scenario. But if it does happen, I would have preferred that be the case than just pop joker. So I'm basically just gonna keep going like this. Uh, no. Yes. That's pretty good. My spirit heart drop, that's fine. Okay. I will open this. It's a library. This is pretty good. Um, I guess we're throwing all but one key at this, <laughs> which is debatable how good that is but what I will try to do is come back and reroll those because there aren't too many books that currently are in the pools so because we already have book of sin and monster manual and now we have all the books that were there so there's like how to jump and some other stuff uh, a book of shadows probably is still in there I wasn't really paying attention to the books that we picked up there's definitely still books left, but we'll we'll figure it out as we go. Alright. Conquest. Well, you seem like a boss that I would generally re-roll your item drop for, but um fuck. That's fine. Help the cross is a pretty sweet thing. So no deal, so let's Joker. Gives us Horror of Babylon, at least. I don't know how good that is. Probably not, but... You know what? I'm, I'm an idiot, so... And we're gonna hopefully get at least one item room item. Ideally, more than one, but I wasn't really paying enough attention. So there's one. So that's actually... So we're, we're gonna get a full... An entire thing of item room items, which is sweet. Yeah, that is sweet. So, uh, I'm perfectly fine picking up the odd mushroom because I do not intend to pick up red hearts. Although we have placenta. No, wait! Ah, oh. Send it back. Give it back to the chef. Tell him he did a fucking shit job. Well, see you later, Horror Babylon. I tried my best. Tried so hard and got so far, but in the end, I fucked up my horror bad. I'm sorry, I didn't. I didn't mean to do that. Lincoln Park, how hip! Yeah, this is kind of what I expected too. Was that I'd be one room short? Get the pop, damn it. Well. Can't be a mini boss either, so secret room cannot have greed in it. Uh, I don't really care about the secret room right now. I'm not gonna use the forget me now. That sounds like a bad idea. Let's just uh, move along. Yeah, it's fine. I made a mistake. It happens. You ever played Isaac and never made a mistake? Specifically while trying to continue an ongoing conversation with 
people that don't respond to you. If not, probably probably don't complain or something. I don't know. I don't really care if you complain about it. Mistakes. Well, I don't believe that I could have gotten more lucky with exactly three pill drops in two rooms on the on the womb too. Shit, I picked it up. Fuck. I'm doomed. Not yet, but I, I will be doomed soon. Whenever Placenta decides to proc. Which could be soon, could be never, honestly. I've actually had entire runs where Placenta hasn't proc once. Although, in fairness, a lot of those runs I've spent the majority of the time at full hearts, but... In which case, Placenta literally cannot proc, so... But it's not like it hasn't- it didn't have opportunities or something. I really just want to be Guppy. Why do all these red chests have to have stupid troll bombs in them? I've had a left hand for a while, and I even have Guppy's tail. Also, keys would be sweet. <laughs> Actually getting keys with which to open the chest chests would be good. I, I think that'd be awesome. That'd be cool. That'd be really sweet. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, darkness, my old friend. See, so if you just repeat the same joke enough, people are bound to laugh eventually. At least that's the way I live my life. It's called the spaghetti effect. I don't know if it's actually called the spaghetti effect, but that's what I learned it as. It's, uh... So think think about it. You got a bowl of spaghetti, right? You just got a big old sloppy bowl of spaghetti. Maybe some sauce on it. Who knows? Maybe it's just some buttered spaghetti. Um, it doesn't really matter. It's kind of irrelevant. I just like to add details that don't belong because that's funny. But, uh... You got a big old, big old bowl of spaghetti. And all you gotta do... Take that bowl of spaghetti, and you just huck it at the wall. Alright? And now every single strand of spaghetti is a, is a thing. You know, it's representative of a thing in this metaphor, right? So let's say jokes. Every strand of spaghetti is a joke, right? And the wall is, like, approval or something. It fucking doesn't matter. Um... But the, the point of the spaghetti effect is that if you throw a bowl of spaghetti at the wall, some of the strands of spaghetti are bound to stick. Right? That's, that's how I live my life. That's how I choose to live my life, I, sh I guess I should say. It would be downright unreasonable for not a single strand of spaghetti to stick. So that's the way to do it. That's how I live my life. Spaghetti effect. Alright, well, I would like that last floor. Ooh, there's a key. Alright. Damn it. It spawned right on top of me. I knew I had limited time to get through or whatever, but. Jesus. Every pill is a balls of steel pill. I'm not complaining about it, it's just weird. <laughs> oh. Haha, <laughs> alright. I'm just gonna finish exploring because it doesn't really matter. It doesn't even matter. There was a tinted rock in that in that room at the dead end up there, by the way. It was just obviously inaccessible. Alright, real talk. For all the shit that Lincoln Park gets, I think they're a pretty good band. New Lincoln Park, it's probably a little bit worse than 50-50. But, it's not just straight up bad, like everybody wants to believe or whatever. Like, um, it's the, there's a song I have on my playlist by Linkin Park that I actually enjoy. I'm forgetting the name of it. Uh, no, I can't remember it. It's a newer one, though. <clears throat> but I, I, I think they get way more hate than they deserve. Can you stop? I mean, like, I'm fine with getting this many balls of steel pills. Like, it's not hurting me in any way. It's just weird, and I don't like it.
just feels weird, you know? So I need to remember to drop the left hand before going down to the chest. Although maybe I don't drop the left hand just because we don't have any keys. If I had more keys, I'd be way, way more inclined to actually drop it. As it is right now, I might not even drop it. Because if we hold on to the left hand, we have a guppy opportunity. And if we ditch the left hand, then we get a shitload of golden chests and can only open two out of the initial four, and then none of the extra from Guppy's tail. So, I don't know. It's honestly a toss-up in my mind. I don't think I've ever thought about it strategically and been like, I want to keep the left hand in the chest. Although I have admitted that it seems possible that that situation would arise. I think this might be the exact... All right. Now I'm way more inclined to da, 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 drop it. Drop the left hand. The word is drop that I'm looking for. Ah, I can't dodge you. You're spooky. All right. I think once we get to three keys, and then easily at four. If we, if we hit four keys before the for the chest, I'm ditching the left hand for sure. Right now, I'm like, I'm kind of on the fence. Whether that's correct or not is yet to be seen, but I, I think I'm on the fence right now. What are you doing on that fence? Get down from there. Stop climbing fences. Can't wait for somebody to take that in their fucking racial context. Nah, I'm a fucking idiot, and I like to climb fences because I'm a dummy. Or at least I did. I used to. Less fences, more trees, but I did I did jump quite a few fences in my day. He says as if he's an old man. Listen, being 21 is basically like being 60, alright? They're close enough, you know... And now, uh, at least one person is probably like, Whoa, you're 21? Yeah, I know. I might not sound it. Or look it. But I'm 21. I don't know, my, my voice is, uh, it's weird. Because my voice has gone through, um, quite a few changes. So what's weird is, when I, when I actually hit puberty, my voice got so deep. Like, super deep. And then... It just slowly got higher pitched and higher pitched until we're at this point. Which is still like not high pitch. It's still like, you know, it, it, it's deepish. I don't know. I'm, it's, it's hard for me to actually like be judgmental about my voice because everybody has the opinion that their own voice is fucking awful or whatever. So I try not to harp on my voice or anything. maybe what seems awful to me is actually beautiful and, and gorgeous to other people. Although I will say, if I, if I had a job as a voice actor, I'd be pretty much ex only uh, given the, the roles where I have to have a deep, or like a, a gross, not so deep raspy voice, like some 60 year old chain smoking woman or something. That'd be my role. That's that's the voice I can voice act. Oh, you want me to do it? No. <laughs> no, no. No. My my throat's actually super uh not good right now. <laughs> so if I did it I I probably would regret it all of tomorrow, so I'm not gonna do it right now. But trust me, I can I can nail that voice. I might do it. I'll try and do a, a light version of it as to not obliterate my vocal cords. Damn it! Damn it! Just give me the fucking Celtic cross effect, you butthole. All right, you're not. You're not gonna get it. Through. I've actually taken so many hits, and you're still not getting it. Through. You're an asshole. I do not like you. What? What? 
What hit me? I didn't see anything. But we got Celtic Cross effect. Go! Grind up inside! Alright, good. Don't take that one out of context, right? Do me a favor and just don't speak of that, what I just said ever again. I can't actually see my body, apparently. That didn't look like it hit me, but I'm blind, seemingly. Alright. It's not a spirit art. We have already dropped the left hand. I will grab this other balls of steel pill as to min max our uh, our current gameplay, I suppose. Our HP. Get me in, get me in! Boop. That one's good. These are not. That one's incredible. That one's not. That one's not great. All right. So, so I'm a Libra. I don't think I have to tell you what why this is great. Um, as you can possibly see, something looks a bit odd about me right now. Don't worry about it. It's relax. All right. Just, just settle down. Calm down. So, soy milk gives you a absolute metric dick fuck ton. That's it's real. Look it up. Dick fuck ton of um of all of your stats. It's good stuff. Oh, where did we pick up keys? Libra. I forgot about Libra. Oh my god, I knew about Libra. I forgot about. It. All right, well let's let's open this one. I don't remember if I've done this before. I feel like I did and it was bad. But I'm I'm a glutton for punishment. Oh, we have Pyromaniac! I forgot! Oh, God, yes! Alright. I guess I should... It's a bit late now, but I, I definitely should re-roll... Yeah, I'm... Hold on to this. Uh, little chub. Nah. Uh, so I'm, now I'm looking for Splash Tears, ideally a Cricket's body. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think we just decreased our damage, which is fine. I've definitely done this before, and I've definitely regretted it every time, so. Oops. This is a, a door that way. Damn it! Alright, I can't avoid damage. I literally can't. I'm not invincible. We have to go through this room every time. That's actually gonna kill me, I think. Sure, dude. This gives us uh, a good chunk of shot speed. Which, obviously, shot speed's not the greatest of stats. But, it also just keeps our tears on screen longer. Maybe it's good. Maybe it's awful. I don't know. We have our homemade Suicide King challenge, except that, uh, can't get hurt. Hot Bombs, you do... do you, you work with Hippocac, right? Or is it Firemind that works with Hippocac? It's probably Firemind. Yeah. I believe Hot Bombs does work with something that explodes. One of the explosive tear effects. I'm not sure, though. So when I said that we we're doing less damage, listen, <laughs> we're still doing crazy high damage. Oh god damn it. Alright, we never have to go through there again. There's nothing on the other side. Don't worry about it. Jesus. Alright, we're actually gonna die. Even though I don't believe I can die. We'll see. We'll see how, how well that holds. How well that theory holds holds true. Let's see how well that actually is, is uh, it works out. Alright, I can't actually control my character. I'm constantly being launched around like a fucking hacky sack. Jeez. Maybe the, 
the uh, my reflection was not a good idea. I'll concede that. Absolutely. Oh god, yeah. No doubt about it, Rotten Baby's great. That's not good. Eh, maybe I take it. It decreases all of our stuff, but it gives us the extra health <laughs> that I kind of maybe need. I do think I need the third uh, heart container to really be unkillable. I think with two, two heart containers, it's too easy to just get hit twice without getting hit by your own explosion. Three is definitely where the safety at. Or even perhaps where the hood at. Alright, we're good. It's fine, everything's fine, don't worry about it. Alright. I'm getting in there. I'm getting all up in that grill. All up in there. Yeah, get in there. Alright. Yep. Jam your face in it. That's all you gotta do is jam your face in it. Alright, well, that was an enjoyable run. Time to end it. Nice, we get to grind up in there with our, our knife. Alright, well that was enjoyable. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I might have thrown a little bit with the Ipecac and the not opening the chest and, the, and such, but hope you guys enjoyed it. As I said, I, w I was a bit tired, so um, yeah. Of course, if you did enjoy it, leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already to see more Isaac in the future. Nine episodes per week, five in the week, and four on the weekends. So look forward to that, and uh, I guess I'll, I'll see you in the next one. This is Tuesdays? Yeah, Tuesdays. So... Got a, got a whole other three episodes before back to Hardcore Weekend, so look forward to those, and I will see you later. Later. Next one, idiot. Later.